Hey guys, uh, my name is Igor Stanig. I'm senior product PR manager for NVIDIA for EMEA region. And I have in uh, my hands here this amazing device called NVIDIA Shield. It's uh, the gaming portable device um, with Android inside. It's powered by NVIDIA Tegra 4. Uh, now the probably the highest uh, performing SOC on the mobile market. Um, it's an amazing device. You can basically play many Android games in probably best quality because the Tegra 4 is the highest performing SOC and we have a full controller support. So you can have like uh, uh, all the games the feeling of the console playing. And besides of this, the device is as well amazing Android device, portable device. You can play the movies, you can listen to music. We have absolutely amazing speakers inside. So these speakers are like, imagine you have a gem box inside of this device. You can easily use it as your portable, uh, portable music device in your home. And besides of traditional Android games, you can as well stream games outside of your PC directly to this device and basically feel like you're playing on a, on a PC, but you play on a, on, a, on a shield. So it could be anywhere in your house and imagine you can just you know, sit anywhere and basically play a games in the same quality or everything on your PC. So my favorite feature of this device is basically battery life when you're playing in movies. So when you travel for the long trips, like you fly, for example, to US, you can easily watch the HD movies up to 20 hours, which is amazing battery life for such such task. So generally, it's a really cool device, and I could only recommend you for any enthusiast gamers and anyone who is interested to either watch movie and plays when you're traveling to look at the device because it's, it's really cool. So the Shield itself is now available only in the US and Canada and uh, for $299. And uh, we didn't announce any plans to bring it outside of the Canada and US yet. So I cannot tell you when this device is available in, uh, in Europe. But on the other hand, uh, the device is not regionally locked. So um, despite the fact it's available only in US, it could be used anywhere in the world. But just now it's available for sale only in the USA.